Hey, GED students, it's GED question of the daytime, and I'm super excited we have reached the kind of pinnacle of these distance style problems uh, that appear on the first five of the GED where you get no calculator. Okay, so let's take a look. It says, what is the distance between 6.2 and negative 3.4 on a number line? All right, a lot of students make a really big error with this, so I don't want to make that error, so I'm going to draw my number line. Now, 6.2 and negative 3.4 are on opposite sides of 0. So let's look. 6.2 is going to be over here on that positive side off to the right. And how far away from 0 is that? Well, it's just 6.2 away from 0, of course. But now look at negative 3.4. Negative 3.4 is even further away from 6.2 than 0 is. How far is it away? Well, it's 3.4 units away. Well, if this piece is 3.4 units long and this piece is 6.2 units long and I have all that distance between these two numbers, I am actually going to have to add that up. 6.2 and 3.4. 2 plus 4 is 6, or 2 tenths plus 4 tenths is 6 tenths, and 6 plus 3 is 9. And I get 9.6, 9.6 away. Now you might say, Kate, uh, can't I do that mathematically? Yeah, you sure can. Difference is synonymous, or distance, I should say, is synonymous with difference. You can do this mathematically by subtracting the two numbers. Now, do remember, though, that difference is supposed to always be positive. So I'm going to jimmy-rig the system by starting with the larger number. So 6.2 is larger. And then from that, I'm going to subtract. Now, careful, I'm not subtracting 3.4. I'm subtracting negative 3.4. Now, you might say, Kate, I don't know how to deal with two minuses in a row. Well, the opposite of subtraction or the opposite of a negative is a positive. And so two minuses in a row turn into plus. And I get that that's the same as 6.2 plus 3.4. And we can see why that visual representation turned into adding there. And I would still get 9.6. So whether you do this mathematically with subtraction or visually with a number line, you can see these two are 9.6 units away from each other. All right. If you have any questions about this or any other GED math concept, be sure to drop your questions in the comments and I'll do my best to answer them.